Hello and welcome to my channel and today I've got for you a mixed haul. Um, I've got quite a few beauty items in here and a couple of, oh yeah, mainly beauty items. So let's get crack-a-lacking. Um, where shall we start? TK Maxx. So I always have a little look in TK Maxx at the makeup and makeup brushes. Um, they do some really nice stuff in there and they often sell off uh, Real Techniques brushes, which I've had a few of in the past. And I saw this. I've actually used it, so I'll get it out in a minute and let you know, let you have a proper look at it. Uh, saw this on the shelf for the grand sum of three ninety nine. Should have been twelve ninety nine. Well, that's how much they sold it for originally. So it's um, a retractable bronzer. Br retract retractable. Oh, start again, Belinda. It's a retractable. I can't say it. It's a retractable bronzer brush. And I thought this would be a nice size for travel. The only problem is it's quite thick, so I might not use it for travel anymore. But anyway, that's by the by, you don't need to know that. So, look at this, you ready? Woo! <laughs> yeah, it comes out to be a nice big bronzer brush. And it's quite a nice big, uh, it's a nice big size. And then the bristles are dense and then they go to a lighter bristle at the end. I've actually already got a blusher brush like this. Uh, I'm not too keen on that, to be honest. So I was, was wondering what this was going to be like, actually. But yeah, I like that. It's really nice. And as I say, it's quite compact. Pops in there. Great for £3.99. I keep saying I won't get any more nails, but these in-home bargains are only £1.99. And I thought, well, I'm going to treat myself. So I've got three sets here. We have got, look at these Bobby Dazzlers. They are called Neon Nights Summer Session. So they're like a, a pinky colour with a slightly orange on the end, like a coral. So I thought they'd do very nice for a holiday. And then Lilac's massive at the moment, isn't it? The Lilac colour. I do like Lilac and I, sh I shall be hoping to get a few Lilac items clothing wise as we go through the season so i need nails to match um we've got here best life so they're three different shades i very rarely wear different shades but i thought they were quite subtle so i thought i might get away with those and they are oval and also in oval just some plain shimmer lilac um they don't look very shimmery to me oh yeah they've got a tiny little shimmer I may well put a little bit of something over the top of those to make them shine a bit more. So yeah, they're just three little bits from Home Bargains. We'll do boots next because I've got quite a few bits from there. Um, I have just realised this whole haul is beauty, so I hope you don't mind. Um, always like to get the old Clinique offers whenever I can in boots. And they had a really good offer on actually. So as I've spoken before, this is my favourite um, facial moisturiser. And the only way I can buy it now is in these sets. They don't sell it in the UK on its own anymore, which is so annoying. But they sell these little sets. I think they're 20 or 25 pounds. I'll pop the price in now. And they're absolutely ideal for going when you go on holiday because they're a little bit smaller. So you get the, um, I don't think, what's in here? Oh, I have got the, I've already got one item in here now because I've started using it. Um, you get a little bottle of the, extra gentle cleansing foam that is a great size for travel and it's one of those that when you squirt it comes out as like a, a foam so i like that a lot now where can i put that so that's really nice um i forgot to say it's the clinic do a, a three step so it's wash tone moisturize so wash with that then you get a little bottle of the toner like that one because it's the one without any alcohol in it alcohol free so it's a lot more gentle on your skin and then the dramatically different moisturizing lotion so yeah really like that now i can take that out of there i don't need to keep that box anymore do you know when you do these videos i have stuff piled up in bags and boxes for weeks sometimes what was that um yeah it's quite annoying i'm like oh just film the video balloon so you can use this stuff so i can use that now and then they were also i don't know how i've acquired this one i can't remember if oh i know what it was there we go 25 pounds they had an offer on i think if you spent 50 pounds you got 10 pounds worth of points or something so i thought okay because there's a couple of bits in here that i like it's the moisture 
I can never say this one either. It's the Clinique Moisture Surge range. The actual tub that's in this range of the facial moisturiser, it's like a gel. I don't get on with it and everybody raves about how good it is, but it's not in here, so I didn't mind. So in here, we've got the Overnight Mask, which is absolutely gorgeous. I don't know if I've got it in here. Yes, took some of the bits out again, use some of them. So that's the overnight mask. These are all sort of travel size as well. Can't use that every day because it is quite strong, but it is an absolutely gorgeous product. Hmm, they don't come with the old hygiene things on the top there. That's a bit bad in this day and age. But yeah, it's a real, it's a lovely thick um, moisturizer. Look at that, really rich, really nice treat for your face. In fact, after I finish filming, I'm gonna pop a bit of that on. I love it. So you get that in the set. You also get, um, oh, that's hardly worth it. Look at the size of that. Flipping heck. Moist, moisture, moisture, oh, I can't say it. Moisture Surge Face Spray. Thirsty Skin Relief. What's that all about? I think that'd be good as a, before you put your makeup on, um, I think that'd be good to spray on a makeup sponge you know, when you make those wet, or I think that'd be really nice. You know, when you're out in the sun and you've got your SPF on, but you get a bit hot, or, you know, maybe if you've dipped in the pool, a spritz of that, lovely. In fact, I took something similar. When we had, um, was it last year we had the heat wave, or it might be the year before now, and it got so hot in my office where I was working, and um, I started taking in a spray and spritz in my face to cool myself down. And then the other two little minis you get are the lip and eye one, so, a bit diddy aren't they but you know i suppose 25 quid for a premium brand this has got like little um blobs in it well, like little balls of stuff that when you put it on i don't know if you're going to be able to see any of them if you can see those and then you as you press down they pop open and the uh the oil or whatever is in them comes out yeah, that's nice. I like that. I've never used that one before, so pleased with that one. And then the one after the um, moisturiser, this is my next favourite one. Years ago, I had a Clinique lip balm that I used so much, but it's so expensive. It's about 20-odd quid. So you've got a little mini lip, and it's just a clear product that, in fact, I'll put a little bit on now. goes on your lips. It's got a nice little ball-shaped thing. And it I don't think it'd be for everybody because it's quite thick, but I absolutely love that. Mm. Yeah, so for £25, I know that might sound a lot to some people, but that's quite a nice gift for somebody, I think. It's a, a you know, a full complete set of um, really nice products. And then because I spent so much, besides from getting the extra points, they had a bonus time on as well. So I'll just quickly go through this. So I got the bag. So if you're not familiar with the Clinique promotions, what they do is you have to buy two full-size products and then you get a bag full of goodies. And what they've started doing now, they let you choose them, which is absolutely fantastic. I used to get so much stuff that I never used. So what I did was I got my seven items, the Dramatically Different Moisturising Lotion, which my mum's now using, so she may well end up with that one. And then the Moisture Surge Mask, which I've just shown you earlier. I got, um, I think I got four of those and three, no, it was th six, I got three and three. So that was absolutely fantastic for me. Another little one from Home Bargains. I saw this, $1.99. Burt Bees is a nice brand. It's an orange blossom and pistachio lip butter. Um, I like lip butters very much. So that is why I've purchased this one. Can I get it open? Yeah, I use um, a raspberry uh, Nivea one and I, yeah, I can't very often see it for sale in the shops now they do other flavors but it's the um, it's the raspberry one I like and I really like it they're really good um, moisturizing lip balms I don't know what it is what what's different between that and a normal lip balm it's the lip butter it's obviously what they put in it that's different let's have a little look hmm oh. not sure on the smell of that one Looks like it's got a little nipple or something. Yeah, I'm not sure on that. I think I like the orange. I'm not sure if the pistachio. It's got a bit of a funny smell to it. Hmm, feels nice though. Can't really tell because I just put that other stuff on. Hmm, 
hmm, I think that's going to be okay. And then also in boots, um, on Caroline Mrs M's YouTube channel, I'm sure I know a lot of you follow her because I've seen your names pop up. She was talking about the number seven range. Get it right, Blin, another number 17 range. So um, depending on how old you are, you might not remember it, but Boots did a number 17 range and it was sort of their budget version of makeup. And for some unknown reason, they stopped it. Now, whether they've had a lot of demand or whether they stopped it to rebrand, I don't know. But it's back. It's back in the shops. So I'll just pop a little um, clip in now because I did do a little video for you. So here we are. We'll start with this bit. So it, they talk about having a look for £10. So five items, £2 each. And then we go on here to the concealers and foundation in lots of different shades. Uh, a few of the products here. These are the mascaras. This is what I was most interested in. So you've got ranging from two to four pounds mascara wise which is an absolute bargain and there's different types in there they've got some lovely eyeliners one of which i shall show you shortly uh, a few more bits here how much stuff can you get on one display it's fantastic look at all the different colors of the foundation surely got to be something there for everybody i think i'm going to try one of those on another occasion when i uh, go back into boots so here we've got bronzers and blush and this was something i like the look of as well it's a, a liquid blush that looks lovely um how much is that one four pounds and then the lipsticks uh, all different shades there again nothing really that caught my eye there wasn't anything quite my color in that but um, I'm sure you'll see something you might like and then of course you've got all the brow products here and then some more lip glosses here and back onto the shadows just showing you a little bit around here and there so yeah, really, really good value and uh, lots to choose from. So well done boots on this uh, rebrand of number 17. So I decided to get myself a couple of bits. Firstly, I got this. I've not seen a green eyeliner before. This was two pounds and I did have a little practice in the shop. They had a tester. They got testers again, which is great. And look at that. It's really good eyeliner. I like that. For £2, it's soft, but it goes on well. Let's see if it comes off easily, though. Hmm. Yeah, it's not waterproof. <laughs> but I really like the look of that. And then my main reason to go was to look at the mascaras, because they did a mascara that I absolutely loved, and they stopped it. So I think they've got, as I've shown you, I think there's about four or five different mascaras there. So I just went for this one, the cheapest. It's called Another Level. Another Level. It was a pop band, wasn't it? Um, and it's a volume mascara, just in black. But I like the brush on this. Look at that beefy brush. Uh, yeah, like a big bristled brush, I do. So if I use this by the time I edit, I'll pop a little um, note in now as to whether it's any good. Let me know in the comments down below if you'll be uh, checking out the number 17 range or if you were a fan of a few years back. I'd be very interested to hear that. And then finally, just a few bits from Superdrug, uh, more nails. Yes, these are in the clearance. Actually weren't that cheap now, come to think of it, but I do love this colour and style. So they were $4.99 down to $3.49, which actually wasn't much of a saving, but yeah, I did like those. Pink petal. Uh, and then I needed some more glue, can you believe it? I didn't actually need some more glue because I've got tons of glue from all the Primark nails I've bought. However, I like my glue in a bottle and I've only got I, I came to put some nails on the other day and I couldn't no the one I got stuck it proper stuck hard um so I needed to buy some more so I got two different types I've had both of these before um they had an offer on buy one get one half price so they were 2 dollars each so I saved a bit of money so I've gone for the elegant touch brush on and the kiss brush on now, I think the Kiss one used to do one in slightly pink colour, but I'm not sure if that's the one. But yeah, both of those are really good. I know a couple of you have been asking me lately about nail glue. So yeah, both of those are fine. So that's that little mini haul done, mini mixed haul. Hope you've enjoyed that. Please do subscribe if you're not already. And drop me a comment down below because you know I love writing back to you. I, I know quite a few of you have got a good rapport now and I always love to hear from you. And of course, if you've enjoyed it. Give me a big thumbs up and I'll see you on the next one. Thanks for watching. Bye for now.